Hey, what is going on everybody? Welcome back to some more Kirby Squeak Squad. On our last episode, we took care of the last boss in Gem and Jungle, and right now we're heading towards a new location, level 5, and let's see what this level is called. Vocal Volcano, okay. So, let's get started, shall we? So on our last episode, we were talking about how awesome that last trailer for Kirby and for Kirby and the Forgotten Land. I, again, I am still excited to play that game. There are other games coming out that I really have my eye, that I really want to play, it, like Bayonetta 3, Splatoon 3. I mean, on the Direct, we didn't get much information from, from Bay we didn't get any information on Bayonetta 3 or, or much information on Splatoon 3. My guess is because it is Bayonetta, I guess Bayonetta 3 isn't coming out until later in the later half of this year so and remember the direct was for the first half of the year so I guess that makes sense that they wouldn't include that in it but I wasn't expecting them to reveal Xenoblade 3 because it isn't that kind of like kind of like you know considered in the second half of the year because they are, aren't gonna be showing that until like September which is when my birthday is but I I don't know I'm not really that much into the Xenoblade Chronicle like the Xenoblade um franchise so I'd be lying to say if I was an actual true fan of the sense I mean I like the concept of most of its game like its physiology Xenoblade 2 was my the one I liked the most I won't lie but let's see I fire fire it burns poor Bronto bird I guess I should use this. Right. Now let's see what we got here. Ooh, another Max Tomato. Cool. Okay, I'll keep it. Alright, so I was saying, yeah, so as I was saying, I wasn't a total fan of the Xenoblade Chronicles. I mean, I do, I, again, I like the physiology, I like the art style, it's just the game mechanics. It's not my run of the mill for an RPG game. I mean, don't get me wrong, I like RPGs, but Xenoblade just doesn't do it for me. I like the story, I like the mechanics, it's just I don't do well. I think we need Cupid for this one here. There we go. Eat it. Alright, dead. Oh, so you don't need to pr constantly press A with this one, okay? Now... See ya. Fly Kirby. These shadows really want to kill us. Okay, so yeah, so where I don't know. I think his name was Jin. That guy with the, the katana sword, that flesh eater from Xenoblade Chronicles 2. I I love. Ow! Will you stop attacking me? I'm trying to give um com commentary here. <laughs> um. So yeah. So. Jido is one of my favorite characters I like playing as. No, not playing as, um, watching. Uh oh. And let this guy steal the, the case. Where are you going with that, you? I'll take that. Get inhaled, Doc! Oh, uh, no, he didn't get inhaled. Alright, well, whatever. We walked away with some food. There we go. Ah, nuts. I went back in. Ugh. Exit stage, okay? There we go. Alright, back to what we were doing before. Ah, nuts! No way, even Firehead gets hurt with his own f um, in his own element. Well, I mean, what I'm talking about, of course he gets hurt by his own element. I mean, he's fighting Kirby against them all the time. It doesn't make much of a difference to me anyway. <laughs> Let me see, Magic Kirby. Let's give him a try. I love that attack. I don't know why they never brought Magic Kirby back. Magic Kirby is like, it could be a great addition. 
to the series. It's magic, Kirby. Like they should have. They, like they, I mean, they should have at least included it in Kirby. Um, and Kirby back, back right at you. But oh well, we will never see it. Make his debut. Got it. Chest, you're mine. Okay. What else? Ah! Why are there so many Bronto birds up here? You litter bugs. You traffic hogs. I feel like there's something up here. I knew it. Food. Ah! Damn it! That food would have come in handy here if I got hurt by a Bronto bird. Ah! Bronto birds are mean! Okay. Ah, you again. I don't know what you're gonna be able to do for us, but let's see what you can do. Okay. Up, 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 up. Good. Stick a doorway here. You're wasting your time. Kirby's indestructible when he's in his metal mode. Metal mode! Heavy Metal? It kind of reminds me of Heavy Metal Man from Mega Man. If you guys n ever wa played Mega Man series. Let's see. Yep, this one comes in handy here. He Maybe slow, but his defense is impenetrable. Let's see. Up, 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 up. Take that. Nope, nothing there. Okay. There you go. Oof. Thanks, Waddle Doo. Beam. Oh, it's spinny. Eat it. Eat it. Ugh. See ya. Whew. The fire really helped me there. Alright, and now we got some more chests. So let's see what treasure we unlock today. So we got a new ability scroll for hammer. Cool. Ooh. I gotta go with sword. Sword is my go to. Let's see what we got in here so far. Ooh. Bonkers! Got him. Alright, let's see what Hammer's gotta, gonna do for us here. Ah, okay. I get it now. We have to defeat the bosses so we can get the chests. Should be simple enough. Because only with these bosses' abilities will be be able to unlock the chests. Oh, come on. Yes. Hammer spin. Hammer spin. Ah, no. Ugh. I'm so out of practice here with this game. I play too much high revolution games and these retro game graphics are really that bad. Are really bad with me right now. Uh. Alright, whatever. Here we go. Yep. Up, 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 up. Good. Come on now. Ooh, you. Oh. That was a fail. Don't die on me, Kirby. Ah. Slash. But this would be an awesome ability to return Kirby and the Forgotten Land. To be honest, Animal Kirby, it would fit the theme. I don't know what they're thinking. But they really need to get their act together. Oof. Okay. Now, down we 
go. I will need this. Where I'm going. You! It's Storo. Everyone run! Got him. Uh oh. Don't get hit, don't get hit. Got him. Ah, uh, do I? I'm hanging by a thread here, folks. Uh, distracting him long enough so I don't get hit is all key. Ah. He's sleeping. Is there any way to get away from him now? Nope, there's no way to get away from him. Got him. Time to get out of here. Is there anything over here? Nope. Alright, let's go. Alright, let's see what we got now in our chests. Cool. Extra life. Our heart meter just keeps going up. Now what's next? What'll do? Oh no, I forgot about you. I can't inhale you. A twister. Nah, but you won't be helpful here either. Oh wait, dang it. That's what I was looking for for the beginning! You, animal! Come here! Now we're together as one. I can really use the health right now. Hmm. Ooh, crazy candy. Ah! Take it. The sparks they add to the after effects really make it kind of almost look cool, like almost 3D in its own way. But that's the best they could do in these kind of graphics back in those days. Like, no, there was no. E they were like, I think there was no HDMI back in the early. Yeah, there was no HDMI back in the 2000s and the, like, the early 2000s. So yeah, fun nuts. Nah! Dead. Kirby! Okay. So let's see. Ice. And this game, he doesn't sl he doesn't ice skate. Ah. Uh, I mean... In most Kirby games, Ice Kirby is blue, he doesn't skate, ah. Yeah, most Kirby games he's blue, he skates, and, and it, does, it makes more look like more of the ice more believable as ice, but I don't know, I guess they were cutting back in this one here. Out. Parasols, damn you. Thank you. My second go to Spark. Oof. What the heck? Okay, I miscalculated that one there. Ouch. Gotta be careful here. Ugh. I keep forgetting about these disgusting green slime things. Up here? Yeah, doorway. 
Nope, don't hit it. Got it. It was a trick. And all you can die in the fire. What do I gotta do here, I wonder? Hmm. Yeah, I won't be able to pass through there. Let's see, what's in here, though? Wheel, huh? Oof. Fire! Oof. Burn! Got him. Alright. I didn't say got him, I said got it. <sighs> I should have said it. Oh well. Doc! Get back here! Uh, where is an ability we can use? Out of my way! Dang it, I didn't want to battle him in here. Because when they're in their hideouts, they get a little too crazy. UFO Kirby! Oh, when he... like this, it's impossible to hurt him properly. First of all, let's get out the Bomb Brigade. Oof. That one I need to get rid of. Die! Dead. See ya, Doc. Whew, that was close. I remember when, when in other Kirby games, I believe they had a feature to UFO Kirby where you could just beam them up inside of your, your saucer, like like aliens abducting like cows and stuff from like old cartoons you would see like and they get taken. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Extra stage. Mmm. That'd be it. Nope, can't go in here. Where? I wonder. Mm. Is this the right place I should go in? Let's see. Nah, I don't think so. Next room! Center? Nope. I think I need to find out the sequence of what action I need to take. Ah, nuts! You! Ah, nuts! I tried. Oof. Eat it, Spinny. Are we becoming some health? That's good. He's dead. Now where do I go? I think I did the wrong thing here. Oh well, I'll have to backtrack later.
Now, to the boss of this level. Oh gosh, I'm getting some serious eerie vibes in this one. Let's see. I want to use High Jump Kirby. Let's see if High Jump, High Jump Kirby can do any different here. Yeah. So, like I was saying, so what else is there? Like, alright, so yeah, let's talk about a little bit of Splatoon. Like, Splatoon, for me, ah, nuts. No, High Jump didn't really do anything much. Let's see if we get anything from this. Nope. That's not the fight. Oh, let's just use the Hyper Candy and finish him off. This will just be a cheap win. Oh, crap. Nope. Ah. What are you, crazy owl raccoon thing? Blast him! Yoo-hoo! Over here! You ain't taking the beat. Nuts. Didn't mess that up. Ah! Hands off! Ow! Oh. Got him. Whew. Close one. And another boss defeated. Alright then, guys. Well, I think that'll do it for this episode. I really did enjoy hanging out with you guys today. So, let just to let you guys know again if you guys may not know I may not have let you know from the last video I'm aiming for 500 subs YouTube has lowered the subscription margin for the community tab so if we can get the 500 subs I can actually open our community tabs and I can be a lot more interactive with you guys so if you can just help a guy out subscribe to my channel like the video and I'll see you guys again for some more Kirby Squeak Squad on our road to Kirby in the Forgotten Land. Until next time, guys, this has been Citrix. Have a good day.